Hey, what's up guys? The Herb here today. I am at Wachusett Reservoir. Look at that. That sunrise over there's gotta be pretty sick. A little red. Sailors take warnings. It's 521 AM. Sunrise is at like 518. The moon's still out. <clears throat> but uh I'm gonna set my rods up. I gotta rig them up. And uh today I'm gonna be going for like rainbows. Um Lake trout will hit the bait I'm going to be using, but not very often. So I'm going to set my rods up for trout. I brought a rod to cast for like bass or any cruising smallmouth that may be around. I, I don't know. Anyways, guys, stay tuned. Uh, hopefully we can't catch some fish this morning. God, it's beautiful out. All right, guys. Well, I got my first rig tied on and it's just simply a Carolina rig um, for you bass fishermen with a egg sinker that slides freely up the main line which is braid um i've never really fished braid for trout before so i don't know how this is going to go but i have a fluorocarbon leader to a small hook off my swivel and uh i think it will work i don't think they should be that bothered by it but who knows trout are kind of keen on stuff like that so anyways i'm gonna throw this out there get my other rod set up and just wait I guess for a bite alright guys when you're trout fishing like this it's uh it's pretty important i think to have some good rod holders all right these rod holders they're made out of copper and uh i think like iron rod or something my grandfather made them uh for beach fishing mainly because you can tie the well you take like a rubber band and you can put the line through it it's a, like it's a good like holder if you want to keep your bail open with a signal bobber um just little things like that makes fishing so much easier. I don't like to keep my bail open for rainbows, at least. I see the bobber go up, I like to get there and set the hook. But anyways, a quality set of rod holders is, in my opinion, important. It just makes fishing so much easier. Ah, missed him. Blew that one. Oh, there's a fish. A little smallie came up and followed it right to the freaking shoreline. <laughs> followed it right up onto the shore. Hit it right here. Took me by surprise, but look how fat that little guy is. He's been eating things like that, swim bait, shad and stuff. And get him back, go get bigger. Sweet, first fish of the day. I don't know if he's still here or not. Yeah, he is. Got him. Feels like a good one. I like using the braid. You can feel him a lot better. Get a better hook set on him and stuff good to know. Doesn't affect the bite either. A 
is the fish. Nice bow. Nice rainbow. A little stocky. I'll take him. Alright, there's the first fish of the day. Nice little rainbow. Pretty colors on him. He, uh, he swallowed the hook pretty bad, so I'm going to keep him. But he was, uh, he was probably stocked this year. Nice little stocky. You know what? He's going to taste awfully good on the grill. So, boom, I'm on the board. All right, guys, so I just reset that rod after catching that fish. Um, this rod hasn't had a hit on it yet, so I'm going to check it. It's always good to check your bait every so often. I like to about every 20, 25 minutes. Just make sure nothing's wrong with it down there. Make sure it's doing what it's supposed to do. Oh my god. <laughs> I was just setting that other rod up. I just checked it and this one got him is freaking running. Feels like a good fish too. Oh man. Feels like a really good fish. Yeah, that's a pretty good one. It's running. It's gonna get me tangled up in that other line. Oh, it's a brown. Oh no, that's a that's a salmon? What? I just caught a salmon on Power Bay eggs in July. I don't know, man. I don't know. Crazy things. All right, guys. There she is. Salmon. Landlocked salmon, I believe. I don't know. Correct me if I'm wrong. Never caught one of these out of a body of water like this. I've caught them out of rivers. Small. But uh, this is my first, like, salmon, like, ever. So I'm pumped. Yeah, I just measured him. He's 17 inches. They have to be 15 inches to keep. Um and you can keep two a day. So one salmon, one rainbow, doing pretty good today. All right, guys, well, it's about quarter past eight. Um, I think I'm gonna pick up, I got two fish today. One salmon, which I've never caught before. Um, here, anyways, I've caught them in rivers, but never caught one before here in open water. That's pretty cool. Caught them on power bait eggs um in july so you know it's a little different and then i got one little rainbow uh they both swallowed the hooks so i'm gonna keep them bring them home and cook them up thanks for watching uh, i hope you enjoyed click that like button if you want to see more about Chuset reservoir uh trout fishing videos from my channel and uh, i'll catch you guys next time